Hey guys, I thought I'd tell you guys some stories from high school. Um, um, yeah. I woke up today feeling very, like, dark and stuff, so I'm, like, in all black and whatnot. And I have these lips and this makeup, and I have a tutorial on how I did my fall fire phoenix hair. I was feeling very, like, inspired by the colors of the leaves they're not those colors yet but they will be and i know they will be so it inspired it <laughs> all right so i remember one time i was walking yeah i was walking into school through a different entrance i think i don't really remember but I remember a girl saying, oh my god, that girl colors her hair too much, it's going to fall out. And I was just like... And then I remember another time, um... Another time, somebody looked at my scars and said something about being emo like he looked at me went emo something and I, just, I don't really remember what he said because I blocked that out um I never really, I wasn't really picked on throughout high school um only through middle school high school I was like called the dyke and I had short hair and somebody they used to like, think I was a boy from behind so that's why I'll never get short hair again even though I love it um, there's somebody walking by with their kids on bicycles. They're like, who the hell is this girl in the window talking to herself? Because they probably see my lips moving. Um, in high school, hmm, I remember my junior year, some, the senior prank, because we had, um, when I was in shop, we had lunch with the seniors. And she just pointed at me and said, look at that girl. I saw you. Anyways, so the senior prank was right on my table, sitting right next to them, and they let off two stink bombs. And I was just like... Sweet. And that's my fucking sister being loud as fuck, like always. She used to shut her mouth sometimes. She annoys me. Just saying. It's just she's always loud and screaming, and it's just like. Don't worry, the key. Is that there? Alright. Anyways. I just had a rage moment. Um, high school. Another memory. Damn. I was a boring person because I have no memories. I remember one time my friend um, hit my boobs like they were bongos in math class and she got excited. And we wouldn't, we couldn't stop laughing over that. We're just like, <laughs> yeah, that was fun. Um, I remember going to a Halloween dance, and my boyfriend came, and I like pecked my friend, like you know, yeah, whatever, just a kiss. This is my friend, like a sister to me. And after that, she would not stop milking me. I kissed, like, a lot of people that night. Pecs. Friends. Pe friend pecs. Not, like, friend pecs. Like, not like, oh yeah, you're sexy, let's kiss. <sighs> no. Um, prom? I didn't like prom. I was... I'm not the dancing person. Back in, like, middle school, when I didn't have so much anxiety as I do now, yeah, I was. 
but now my anxiety is higher than higher than space okay higher than space that I just I was just like mm-mm mm-mm no not gonna happen uh, graduation. Now that was, that was interesting. That was very interesting, actually. Because all of a sudden everyone starts whipping out balloons. I'm just like, what's, what's going on? What am I missing right now? They're like, yeah, when the last person walks, throw them in the air and just start popping them. And they would be past colors, I think. But they were like blowing them up as people were walking by. And I was just like. Sitting there just looking at everyone like. Okay. Okay. I didn't have one though. Because I'm good. Um, so yeah. And the last boy walked. And all of a sudden, they start playing, like, the song or whatever it is. And they just start throwing the balloons and they're popping. It literally sounded like fireworks. I'm not even kidding. It sounded like fireworks. Like, I'm not even. I'm. There were just, just so many balloons. So many balloons. I was scared for my life. I was scared. They could have been setting off fireworks. I wouldn't even know. But we're inside, so they probably weren't. Um, I almost passed out of graduation rehearsals for my anxiety. That was awesome. I started having a panic attack. Graduation. I got there. I was I was that close. I was like, holy bananas! There's a lot of people. Whoa, my voice just sounded so weird. We have two hundred forty two seniors two didn't walk I think yeah so that's a lot of um, peoples so we can have I think it was six tickets each so and a lot of people a lot of people requested more so just think about it think about it that's a lot of people I was like, and they were saying, I'm going to pass out in my teacher from junior year. I was like, no, you're not. You'll be okay. I was like, no. No. That would be really funny if I feel like passed out and fell off the stage. That would have been funny. Honestly, I would go out with a bang. Literally. Because I would have banged my freaking head. Or something. I would have created a thud. Um, uh, wow, my... Mm, I am horrible. I don't remember nothing with high school. I, I don't remember nothing. And I wasn't even stoning like majority of the kids were. And I just don't remember nothing. Nothing. I don't, I don't even know. I didn't even know what I did yesterday. What did I do yesterday? Oh, I watched Supernatural. And slept. Because I have no love. And I have no friends. And nobody wants to hang out with me. Or talk to me. But I have plans today. Yay! And Saturday, Saturday, I'm scaring our haunted hayride. I've been scaring that since I was eight years old. That's a long time. That's like 11 years. Almost 12, because I'm almost 20. Actually, it is 12 years. Because it's the 12th year, even though I'm not 20. I'm turning 20 this year. Wait, I probably totally did that math wrong. I've been in a school for too long, okay? <laughs> it's only been a few months. It's 
still. I'm a little. No, but honestly, I convinced myself that 4 plus 7 equals 10. Yeah, I convinced myself that. I was really tired. I was just like, no, it's definitely 10. It's, it's definitely 10. But it wasn't 10. It wasn't 10. He texted me. Hey, girl. I do got friends because someone just texted me. Whoop, whoop. And that person wants to hang out with me on Halloween. But I don't really know what I'm doing yet. But if I'm doing nothing, then heck yeah, girl. You come over here and we chill like bunny rabbits. And if you're watching this video, you know who you are. Because I told you my YouTube channel. And yeah. So hi. You're pretty girl. And don't even don't even because you're beautiful there ain't nothing wrong with you you're gorgeous and i love you and you're pretty in your hairs and i'm jealous of your bod girl all right i'm done because this has been going on for far too long and i'm probably bored the fuck You know, I stick out my tongue when I'm feeling very uncomfortable. Just to let you guys know. Sometimes I stick out my tongue like, nah. Right, I'll go. There you go. Like, I don't do that, but go. Or go. Or I don't fucking know. It was in, um, my Tumblr video. I went, I don't fucking, I don't know. But that's what I do when I'm feeling very, very uncomfortable. I stick out my tongue. Okay, so, bye.